So, what made you get into presenting? Do your environmental surrounding or just presenting? Uh, I've always wanted to present. That's all yeah. I've ever wanted to do. Throughout school, I've been in plays. I've studied music. I've studied television. I've always had, you know, um, I've always been interested in the arts. Yeah. So, growing up, I've always wanted to either be an actress or a presenter. Always. And then finished uni and thought, no, I definitely want to be a presenter. Great is a form of presenting. Yeah. Kind of they work quite yeah, well together. Skills. Yeah. In a different way, you're not yeah. so dramatised when you're presenting, but you still can get to grips with some of the things you remembered or you learnt back at school. So So what did you actually study at uni? At uni I studied media and cultural studies. Okay, yeah. So it's quite a varied subject <coughs> in that you learn a lot of theory and it's only really in your third year that you get to actually go out and experience hands on. Um, you know, what it's like to be in a media industry, what it's like to work in television or what's work in radio. So my, for my case, my third year, I went to work at Belgian Radio. And um, that was great because I actually went to find me after three years going to a studio and see what it's like. Because I've never been, I've only ever read about it. So I went into a studio, you know, saw what it's like, got to play the mics and all the bits of equipment. I was like, yeah, 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 I want to do this. But um, as I said, experience is great because you it opens you up, it le lets you see that there's more to life than what you see perhaps on TV. Being a presenter is not just about being on television, it's also about being on radio. You can be a presenter, you know, working for a magazine, doing interviews, that sort of thing. So. Alright, I've seen that you've done a lot of magazine work and fashion shows and things like that, and you did say that you prefer to do radio work and modelling, but what about theatre and screen? Theatre and screen? Um, I don't know. Oh, um, is that not really your field? No, I think going forward, in the way in the future, yeah. theatre acting would be something I'd love to do. Okay. Um, but it's not something on the agenda for the time being. I really, really do love being on radio. Okay. And, um, and being up on, on a stage, but not as an actress. <laughs> So what's your um, working relationship like with individuals in the industry, like people you've met along the way? What is my, sorry, what was your working relationship? What's my working relationship been like? Always be nice to everyone. <laughs> In this industry, you'll come across the same people time and time again, or you'll come across somebody that knows of someone you know. Yeah. So try and try and be as, as approachable as you can. Be friendly to everyone, um, even if it's not in your nature. Just try to be like that because everyone knows somebody that can perhaps help you. And it's about networking. I'm sure everyone goes on about the same thing, yeah. networking, networking, but it really is because in in London we're not like in the US where there's a vast amount of people. Do you know what I mean? There's actually a small amount of people in the UK. Yeah. And everyone knows everyone else and everyone works whether it's in photography or filming or whatever it is, everyone can help each other. So um, my working relationships are really good. <laughs> I hope everyone will agree with me. But um, I still contact I'm still in contact with all my students my tutors from uni. I go back okay. and give talks at my old uni, which is great. I get to meet the students that are coming up through the ranks and wanting to be presenters and I talk to them. And I still speak to the first person that gave me my presenting job ever. Do you know what I mean? So it, I don't forget those people. Yeah. And I like to help others as well. I'm really big on going back to uni and talking to students mm -hmm. that want to get into it. They're so full of energy and I can give them advice. A little bit of advice that I have. All right.